Hello Zebraherd, welcome back to Super Smash Bros. Ultimate. Today, we are finally hopping back into World of Light. Of course, I've taken a tiny bit of a hiatus from it because last, not last episode, but the episode before that, I checked out the Spirit Board in the limited time Mario Spirit event because there were some exclusive spirits to it. But now we're getting back into this. Of course, we were able to unlock Snake in the previous World of Light episode and went through this whole Metagur Salad area. Not fully completed it, unfortunately, because there are some really tough battles in there, but I figure, I've spent a lot of time just simply getting caught up in really tough battles that I sort of want to try to not do now. I want to just sort of try to keep moving forward, make our way through the story, and once we have a really powerful combo of spirits and stuff, then I can start worrying about that a little bit more. I'm like, whatever this fight was. I don't think we ever did this one. Yeah, this is uh, Squitter from Donkey Kong taking over Diddy Kong. Um, the conditions are you have, to re you have reduced move speed. That shouldn't be too bad. And we'll do something like that, because we get our move speed back up. And so we played a little bit of Snake in the last episode. I figure we'll go ahead and play somebody else. Taking a look at it. You know who I want to play? I want to play Inkling. I have no clue how to play Inkling, and this might turn out awfully bad because of that. Because I know there's some kind of like thing going on with the, the spraying the ink and stuff. But you know what? I've been in a pretty Splatoon mood. If you guys haven't seen, I've been uploading. Um, I'm at episode 99 in Splatoon 2. I'm approaching episode 100. Super excited for that one. But we'll try this out. So my speed is back up. Oh, that's very weird. Oh, okay. Wait, where is he going? He's going this way. Okay, got him. I have no idea how Inkling works, but I know that I need to like cover the, the ground, right? Because if not, you, you can't really move very easily. I don't know how well this is gonna turn out, <laughs> but we'll try it. So far, we're tearing him up. Oh, give me this. Oh, did that hit him? I don't know. Oh, well, that's weird. That was good. Ooh, that's like one of, yeah, there's so many different weapons here. That's so cool. Oh, this has such a huge range. When it actually lands, it's super huge. No, nope. no wait. Okay, that was good. Mm, that was really good. Okay, we got him. We were out of ink there too. But I kept spraying and none of it was getting onto the floor, but we got sticky four immunity. I don't think we've had that yet, so that's pretty good. Squitters from Donkey Kong Country 3, I believe, so very cool. Oh, Pokemon Arceus. Luigi kick. Don't tell me about Luigi. I don't have him yet. <laughs> oh well. That's another spirit battle done. I definitely will look for different places to enter because I know that if we like we take a look at the map. I'm looking to get into the fortress on the top left. And to do that, I definitely need to press another button. But I know there's like a whole other city I've yet to explore. There's like a lot of stuff I need to touch up on. And then maybe I should clear out the map a little bit. Oh, we got Wiggler here. Should be pretty easy to be honest with you. I'm just gonna do whatever the game wants me to do at this point. Like I'm pretty exhausted when it comes to choosing spirits. Unless it's something like I'm specifically having an issue, like maybe then I'll like experiment. But it's a yellow Yoshi. That's technically a Wiggler. So like how there's no ink on the ground there? I mean, I guess you can't ink the floor then? Maybe you can only ink opponents? I don't know. That does some damage. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, almost got you with that one. Hold on, there we go. Oh, I wanna roll ya. I wanted to roll ya. That would've been awesome. Oh, oh no. Come on, I'm running out of ink. But I did get some ink on the floor there. I guess it doesn't matter too much. Ah, oh, man, inkling is weird. <laughs> Okay, it's this lipstick. I think we actually already have a Wiggler. Yeah, we got that from the Mario event as well. So that should be a duplicate we can we can like summon away. That will be cool. So there's that area open up to. I don't know what it'll lead, but I'm excited to see. Ooh, tons of clouds being wiped away. And, and a chest is chilling out. What do we get? A thousand spirit points, not bad. And then what is this area up here? Okay, well, I mean, I don't know what's with this sort of building. Is there any way in there from here? I guess not. Odd. You can go right by it, but it's, it doesn't have like a clear entrance. But this whole city, I know that, uh, what's it called is here. Um, Pauline is here and she's very difficult. I'm gonna avoid her. But we had the Wii Fit series, deep breathing, Wii Fit trainer team, time battle, the enemy has increased it, uh, defense and the enemy heals over time. That should be fine. Usually these teams, they're not so bad, so we'll be able to tackle it. But I'll just be getting done as much as I physically can in today's episode, and hopefully that turns out okay. Okay, so start working on right away. Ooh. Oh, but I actually got her stuck underground there. Oh, that's cool. Hmm, and then try that out, oh boy. But they are all healing over time because of their deep breathing. Let's try to do some grabs. That was pretty good. Oh gosh, oh gosh. I feel like I might need, what was she doing? <laughs> she was just wiggling on the floor. That was really weird. Okay, got her. Whoa, be careful. Okay, I got that. I missed. 
Okay, so how do I get ink back? I don't know. I mean, it doesn't mean I'm a, I can't attack. It just means I have a, oh, she got me. I wanna rematch real fast. It's such a weird character. I feel like obviously I am a long ways out the showcasing Inkling, but I'll definitely have to do some learning for it. Okay. Yeah, I guess I have lipstick right now. I don't know how good of an idea that actually is. Okay, so like what if I, can I then, like, okay, how do I stop and then, I can't go into the ink though. Like I'm, unless I'm just pressing the wrong button, I don't think I am now. It's very weird. Huh. Mmm, send you up, and then send you up again. Ooh, that was really good. And then, oh, how did that not hit you? How did that not hit you? Get you out of here. How do you, what is going on? Where am I? <laughs> I don't know. Oh boy. She's really high on health now. Because I can only use like, like neutral smashes, or not neutral, but like just smashes. Like the special moves won't really work because I'm out of ink. I don't know how to get ink back. Oh, I got my, ooh, I got my smash. Oh, it's not gonna hit anybody because I missed them all. That's just embarrassing. Oh, but it can keep going and I can keep fighting over this way. Oh, that's weird. I do like it, but man, is that odd. Come on, come on. Because they keep healing themselves over and over again. They won't let me on the floor. So I might just have to change characters because I don't know one one thing. Which character is low on health? It's sort of a mess. So I just need to play a character where I can actually use my, my uh, special moves. She's fun for sure and I'll probably switch back to her, but I just need to learn how to play her. <laughs> Okay, so who else do we want to play as? We could try um, Mega Man a little bit. That might be fun. I don't know why I'm playing characters. Like, I want to play characters I'm new with. Just because, you know, that's fun. But I think we'll be fine with this. Just keep doing some deep breathing. <sighs> and we'll get it. So, I don't know. I don't want this. <laughs> Ooh. Oh, yeah. Let's keep throwing this stuff. There you go. That helps. <laughs> okay. Ooh. But yeah, he has all of his, you know, cool Mega Man moves. Which I like. There we go, there's the Mega Buster. Do a grab move. I like it. Ooh, ooh, that's super good. There we go, get rid of one. I don't know why she's just doing push-ups all over the place, that's super weird. Okay, go for the grab then, and then. Nice, I got her, I got her. No, oh, that's so much easier. <laughs> we got him, super easy there. Deep breathing slightly increases the power of down special moves, not bad. So I got that figured out. I like down special, most of the time. Okay, so with that being done, we got ourselves a treasure chest and inside we get ourselves. Ooh, 20 skill spheres is quite a lot. We definitely need to, you know, let's go ahead and do that now. Um, let's go to our menu, go to our skill tree. How many How many spheres do we have? We have 68 of them. Um, this is shooting items up, increases the power of ammo and shooting items. The power and ammo of shooting items. And then this one is attack up one healthy. Ooh, I will check that one out sooner or later. So people were saying that I might not be able to fully fill out everything on the spirit board, which sort of, or the skill tree, which sort of disappoints me I want to be able to. I'll be trying my best. We got Tsubasa or eBay. And they actually have inkling. Okay, I see the resemblance. They're both wearing like school clothes. Uh, hostile assist trophies will appear. I'm guessing she's one of them, or something relating to her game. I'm not really sure. I'm not very familiar with this at all. But we'll try it out, we'll see what ends up happening. So as long as we can get rid of Inkling, like that's the big thing. I don't know if his uh, up special actually does any attacks, like, like it actually hurts or anything. I'm trying to find out. I don't know if this counts as a trophy. We're tearing you up. Oh, get the buster. Mmm, that is so cool. I love Mega Man already, he's cool. All right, so we get Tsubasa Uribe. I hope I pronounced that correctly. I apologize if I haven't, but she does enhance at level 99, which is pretty cool. Okay, so with that done, we're gonna keep moving forward and see what other spirits we can take down in this little city. Cause this is like the Nintendo themed city. Like there's like a, I think there's like a Super Nintendo building right above us. There's a GameCube over there just chilling out. We got the tractor trailer from Stunt Race FX. Huh, interesting. Uh, the enemy side special has increased power and the enemy's favor side specials, of course it's Morton Koopa, which is pretty cool. We'll do something like this, sure why not. We'll throw the green shell at you. I really like Mega Man so far, he's fun. He's got some different moves to him. He's another one that we're pretty far out the showcasing, but. Right now I can throw a Koopa Shell and miss it. You jumped over. I mean, I guess Koopa Shells are from your series. Does anybody? 
It's gonna be able to dodge them. It's gonna be a turtle from Mario. Okay, that was good. Nice. And then, what what happened there? I don't know. Whoa. Oh, did I put a, a, a Crash Man bomb on myself? I think that's what it was from. What, Robot Master. Mmm, not bad, not bad. There we go. Ooh. And we move really fast. I don't know if that's, that might be something we have equipped. Or maybe because our weight is down because of blooper? Okay, dodge, dodge. Ooh, not bad. And then once he comes back, there it is. That is so much fun. He's a lot more of a viable character than I was expecting. All right, breaking ability, stopping easier when walking or running. Okay, actually not too bad. I'll take it. Get another skill sphere for that one. And Wolf, Team Star Wolf, Final Smash. I don't wanna learn about that yet, that's spoilers. <laughs> Okay, so what is going on this way? We got Cap'n, which we already have Cap'n, just in a boat, but this is from Wild World. Uh, it's a stamina battle and hostile assist trophies will appear. So let's go ahead and try to take out Luigi as fast as possible. That might be our best bet. If it's just one Luigi, then yeah, like before too many of the assist trophies actually show up, we might just be able to beat him up. Oh, there's Cap'n. I don't like this. I don't like this one bit. Mm, yeah, keep launching him. Whoa. Hold on. Dang it, I don't know what happened there. I, sometimes, I don't know, there's like, I feel like my buttons don't translate into the game, because I was trying to jump an up special and I just, I saw myself just keep falling. <laughs> I don't know. We'll try it again real fast and see how it works. Hopefully a little bit better. Okay, just go at him right away. Oh, no wait, how do you put it back on me? <laughs> I just gotta, it's a stamina battle. I just keep going, I'll be fine. There we go, ooh, executed him pretty good there. Watch it, watch it, watch it! There we go, oh, that was good. No, 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 get me off this bus. <laughs> I don't wanna go. Oh, no, 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 stop doing that. <laughs> oh, I don't like it. Oh, no, wait, get me out of here. I don't like that one bit. Okay, he jumped over me. Come on, he's so low on health right now. Mm. Okay. What do you think you're doing? Got him, okay. Took a little bit of work there. But it's well worth it. We still had 120 HP, so we're fine. And we unlock Captain Wild World. Dash attack increases tackle and dash attack power and slightly increases move speed. Gotcha. So we get two skills first for that one as well, which is pretty good. Leaf Shield is his down special. Mega Man's down special is Leaf Shield, which is, of course, from Mega Man 2. Try to check that out soon. And woo! Oh, that's Captain's bus! Okay, so we can ride that around at some point. Very peculiar, but I love it. So there's a new thing to do over that way. In the meantime, we gotta go down here where we have Infinite from Sonic the Hedgehog um, from Sonic the Lost World. Came out like a year or so ago. Uh, the Hazardous Screen Flip, which we definitely have immunities for. So let's try this out and hope it turns out okay. The screen will suddenly flip after a little while. Stamina battle, the enemy is metal. Oh, I don't have any extra stamina, but I think I'll be fine. Oh, I missed him. Come on, get him. There we go. <laughs> okay, tearing him up pretty well so far. Oh, I like that, actually. I just did his leaf shield. All right, grab him. So, like, obviously, I'm, like, beating him up pretty well already. Like, he can't really do too much about it. <laughs> All right, see you, Sonic. I'm having a pretty easy time right now, but it's just, like, when you run into those tough ones, it gets really crazy. Like, the Pauline one, I just don't even want to deal with that one. It's so tough. And it's, it's also in a place where I don't need to take it on, you know? So I'll leave it for later which is this one right here. Like, I don't need to, it's like a nice shortcut. Ah, uh, I wanna try it once, but I'm not going to. Instead, I wanna focus on this stuff over here. We got Oil Panic from the Game Watch series, of course, taking over a team of Mr. Game & Watches. The stage platforms are very slippery. Good to keep in mind. I mean, we've been doing pretty well with the auto select, which is nice. Okay, sorry if I sound super congested. It's because I am. <laughs> Ready? Oh, this one seems a little, like, laggy almost. That was weird. Oh. So this is an interesting map, because we're actually like on the Game & Watch screen, which is awesome. But like, the borders aren't actually borders? No, no, no. How did that happen so often? Uh, I think that's a new, like, is it the neutral special that puts on the bomb? No, it has to be the side special then. I don't know. Anyways, can I have this Koopa shot? I'm just gonna toss it at you. And then, oh boy. 
This has been a very weird battle. <laughs> Get over here. Like, Mr. Game & Watch moves super weird. He's another one of my favorites from Brawl, though. I think he was in Melee, though, as well. Ooh. There we go. No, wait. Oh, the guys are hitting me. I didn't notice that was, like, a stage hazard. No. Oh, come on, I almost got you here. You're not getting me. That was good. All right. That's another battle done, and because of that, we get Oil Panic, become immune to sticky floors, which I think we already had with the, uh, the spider earlier from Donkey Kong Country 3, but it's good to have more than one. Options are always nice. We already know about Latias and Latios. We already got those spirits a while ago. Okay, and look at this, this is a little N64 right here. Like, oh man, this whole the whole town is pretty cool. We got Master Doc Lewis, ooh, from, of course, uh, Punch Out, taking over Little Mac. Uh, attack power up, defense up, move speed up, condition is stamina battle, the enemy has increased move speed and the enemy has increased defense after a little while. So I think that might be a bit of a challenge, but I think we can do it, taking on Little Mac. Which I think Little Mac is actually bigger than Mad Mega Man. Ready? Eh, they're about the same size. <laughs> they're obviously proportionally very different. I feel like Sma or Little Mac is another character that Smash gave a lot of personality to. Not to say they didn't have personality before, but like it added a lot to it. Mega Man's a lot of fun so far, though. Like, I'm actually, I'm surprised with how much I enjoyed him. Not like the, that I expected him to be awful. He just didn't seem like a character that I would think I would like, because, like, Mega Man in his games is a little bit slow moving in a way. Like, you have to be sure with every movement in Mega Man, or you're gonna get torn up. Oh, that actually hit him. That's good. See, I don't think my up special actually hurts, though. I love that move. And then, come on, can we get Leaf Shield? Oh, it didn't really work the way I wanted it to. Okay. Get out of here, stop this, oh geez. That's good, and then, how did that not hit you? I don't know. I'm just gonna grab you. No, I, I grabbed you. No, wait. <laughs> oh my gosh, grab him, that was good, that was good. That was also good, and then, I'm gonna throw these if I can. Whoa, 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 stop. That was good. Oh my gosh. Come on. Oh, I got my, oh, oh, wait, wait, wait. There it is. Whoa, that is so cool. What is happening? It's a whole bunch of different Mega Mans. Ah, oh, that is awesome. I'm only familiar with like a couple of those Mega Mans. Oh, but he has his now. I gotta be careful, because I almost got him. There he goes. No final smash for you, buddy. Look at me, wee. Awesome. So we get Doc Lewis for that, the Master Spear, and along with it, we should be able to get into his dojo. It's his trophies, Ghost, Blinky, and Inky. And there's also two others, I forget their names. It's like Clyde and then something else. I think it's Inky, Blinky, Stinky? I don't think it's Stinky. <laughs> okay, uh, let's try this out. Um. Okay, the gym. Train your primary spirits in the gym to raise their levels. You can leave them in the gym to grow while you're adventuring. Okay, this is actually really nice. We can actually improve the levels. Looking good, baby, now what it'll be. Um, yeah, let's just get some spirits in here. Maybe some ones I don't use too often that are like level one. Yeah, level one spirits I definitely wanna be able to get. What is with the down though? Will they go down in level? I have no clue. We'll try also getting a grab in here though, like whatever level one grabbing characters we can get. You know, it only recommends level one characters. Oh, well maybe because I do it by level ascending. Uh, and we'll do this one. And some of them are already getting level ups from it. How cool is that? And then we'll get a neutral in here as well, if we can find one. But let's get Rayman. I love Rayman. Okay, we got a couple of those. That'll be pretty cool. We'll just leave them in there and just level up because, you know, it's pretty useful. All right, we got Bomberman. Nice, Bomberman series, Bomberman taking over Toon Link. Uh, rules, assist trophy enemies, and exploding types are the items. The enemies, explosions, and fire attacks have increased power and hostile assist trophies will appear. So let's go ahead and work on that a little bit. And hopefully this will turn out well. A lot of people wanted Bobberman to play, be a playable character in this game, unfortunately, it seems like he's not, but hey, maybe he'll be DLC. Okay. Uh, gotta be careful that assist trophy. Whoa, ooh, 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 ow, that hurt. Hold on, oh gosh, can I make it? I can, but barely. Oh gosh, I don't like this very much. Whoa, whoa, I didn't even see that thing. Didn't even see it. I am not doing too much to Toon Link right now. That's a fake Smash Ball. Don't hit it. Oh, that was totally by mistake, but it worked. I can't believe I was able to knock the fake Smash Ball into him. And there's another one. That's another fake Smash Ball. Don't you dare, no. Ah, oh, darn it. 
Oh, well. Looks like he got the last lap with that one. I'm going to try it again. I think we can handle it. It's tough for sure because there's like a lot of stuff happening on screen. Ready, go. But I think that if I can start with some good attacks and not get beat up right away. Oh, try to dodge that because the bomb hits everybody, it seems. Like it doesn't pull any punches in that way. Ooh, that was bad, that was bad. Don't tell me I'm already defeated. <laughs> oh boy, no. Ooh, nice, okay, there goes there goes Bomberman. And then I'm gonna try to grab, never mind. Jeez Louise, dude, that's not even fair. <laughs> Come on, one more time. This one's not easy. There's just like a lot of stuff. Hard knuckle down air attack, Mega Man's down air Ready? attack. I think he means like this down air? Has to be. Okay, I'm playing really bad right now. But I don't think he takes as much damage from it as I do. Jeez, I got comboed into it. That is so not cool, but I'm still alive. I'm still going. Oh, pick this thing up and toss it at you. That sort of kind of worked. Ooh, 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 okay. And then. Oh, he just barely dodged that thing. That is so difficult to do anything about. I don't know if I can do this one. Like, I might have to choose different spirits. I feel like my spirits weren't all selected very well. So I'll go at this one more time. If it doesn't work, then I'll try to change things up a little bit, see what else I can get done. Because it's a real challenge so far. That's good. Now if I could just keep doing this over and over again, I want to complain. Oh, he threw the boomerang at me. How rude. Whoa, watch it, watch it. Uh, I mean, I'm keeping up with him a tiny bit more than usual. Go for it. What, why did my thing explode? Oh, come on, that's total baloney. Oh, did he just fall? No, that was Bomberman. Oh, I was so excited there. So hopeful for a better situation than what I'm getting here. Okay. Get over there, I'm getting him. No, I'm not. Oh, it's so impossible. What the heck do you do about that? Oh, he exploded himself, see? That's what I mean. I don't know what it is, but most of these are just waiting around to get lucky enough that the character takes themselves out when it comes to these like ridiculous ones where there's just items and bombs everywhere. There's no real strategy beyond get lucky. Like there's certain spirits you might be able to choose to make it easier. Like I uh, chose a spirit that gives me killing edge and that made it easier to hit him. But beyond that, it's like, it's 95% luck. Anyways, we're able to get that done, but you can see that there is something, I can't just get over there. Mmm, that stinks. I wish there was a way I could unlock these doors, but I don't see a way to from here at the least. And we've already gone over that way. So if we want to continue anywhere, oh, it's Buzz Buzz from uh, Earthbound. <laughs> Taking on Tiny Mr. Game and Watch. Uh, the conditions are timed battle. I do, I do sort of see the similarity between uh, Buzz Buzz and Mr. Game and Watch. Okay, let's give it a shot. We might be able to do this, we might not. Only one way to find out and that's to get into it. All right, buddy. Where are you? Oh, he's so tiny. Oh, he really is Buzz Buzz. Buzz Buzz is like a tiny fly who hits really hard. You gotta be careful. I can't see him. I actually cannot see him right now. There we go. <laughs> but he gets taken out in one hit because he's a fly. Oh my gosh, initial damage 30%. Not too bad, actually. I mean, maybe, because the opponent doesn't take initial damage. Okay, then that's not really that great. Then what's the point? <laughs> if it's gonna, if you're gonna be worse off, then what is the point of the spirit? Who knows? Um, but there's a couple of different ways we can go. Like there's a chest over this way that has Mario Tennis from Mario Tennis Aces. I burped, I'm sorry, I didn't mean to. But of course, Mario Tennis Aces a game we love to play earlier this year, and I'm still playing with every character that gets added each month. Uh, hostile assist trophies will appear in the enemy favors smash attacks. Very cool. Oh, look at this, we're on like some kind of like a, whoa, whoa, that was weird. Everything like slowed down for a second. Okay, hold on, I get the joke, I really do. I can't move, what is going on? That was like so weird, I honestly like, is it like slowed down, like slow motion? I think it was. Okay, now now that those guys are gone, the Pong thing, I sort of, I'm doing a little bit better. Whoa, whoa, grab them, nice. Okay, hold on. Where am I? <laughs> hold on, hold on. I'm not doing so well anymore. And the Pong thing's back, what do you know? Okay, that was decent. No, 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 hold on. No, no, get me out of here. I'm gonna try that. I almost landed it. 
and then I'm just going to charge up and let it rip. Mario, no, no, Mario does not. Mega Man does. Get him in there. I was hoping I could hit both of them at once, and I almost did, but at least we'll be able to blast Mario with this. Oh, no, that was Peach. Okay, perfect. So we'll be able to get rid of her at the least, so. That's good. That's nice. Really turning this around on him right now. And then, no, come on. You got lucky with the Pong there. There it is. Awesome stuff. I feel like our horizontal movement is slowed down during the Pong thing. It's very weird. Uh, grants a 5% chance to land a devastating critical hit. Interesting. That's a, nice, that's a nice spirit right there. So I'll gladly take that one. I wanted to support one anyway, so good to see it. And let's keep moving. That was Woohoo Island, I think that map was, maybe. Uh, we get a treasure chest out of this one, and as you can see, that is gonna be... Ooh, the me headgear, the, the chomp hat. <laughs> I like that one. Whoa, what's happening? Whoa, whoa, it's Master Hand! But, hey, rude! I just got Bomberman now, so I don't care. <laughs> I mean, and we're also the blue bomber, Mega Man, so you really think that was gonna stop us? Not a problem. Whoa, what is this place? It's locked off. Oh, that wasn't really worth it, was it? Oh, we're way down here. Interesting. It'd be a nice shortcut if it wasn't for the fact that there's stuff in the way. So where are the buttons that we're missing at? Because we are missing a couple, of, there's a button up north, for sure. I don't see any others out here. So that's what I'm gonna keep looking for. We're just gonna try, today's the quest to hit the button. <laughs> we'll try to get it. It might be the last one, but it might not be. Can I not get up here from, I thought that maybe I could walk up these rocks. Oh, that's gonna make the whole situation a bit more complicated. Unless I wanna walk down and go through the Candyland area, because I think I might be able to. Yeah, just go down this way. Okay, yeah. Panther Caroso from Star Fox, taken over by Wolf. Uh, the enemies has increased move speed. Let's try it. Yeah, but I'm really enjoying Mega Man. He's been fun. Definitely wanna try him out a bit more. It's weird, it's weird that Wolf has an eye patch. It sort of just ends. <laughs> it doesn't go all the way around his head. Whoa. Oh, well, he is definitely fast. But is he fast enough for us? I don't think so. Come on, try to get up here, see what happens. Oh, that actually worked. <laughs> oh, to be honest with you, I was not expecting it to work. No, watch it. Grab him, I'm trying to grab him. It's not turning out so well. Okay, you know what, buddy? Oh, what is this? Oh, nice. I gotta avoid that now at all costs. Like, try not to get all forgetful about it. Oh, not exactly what I wanted to do. I'm trying to hit him with my down smash. Okay, this probably won't work. Yep, it did not. Oh, he dodged that. Good move. Oh boy, no, no, no. I don't know if the mine is still over there, but I'm gonna try throwing it. Oh, wait, yeah, it's gone. Oh, that's a shame. I don't like that. Oh, you wanna throw blasts, huh? Well, this is what happened when you try to throw blasts. He looks so surprised, he was like, oh! All right, Panther Caroso. Doesn't have anything too special about him, but it's still cool to get. All right, it's Pokemon Lugia. Lugia will launch Aeroblast, a wide range attack. Gotta keep that in mind. So we got one more battle to do before we get to the button and a new character, which is pretty cool. Fire Emblem, uh, Nina taking over Palutena. Conditions are to defeat the main fighter to win. The enemy tends to avoid conflict and the enemy heals over time and being defended by Ganondorf. All right, so we just gotta get rid of Palutena though. We don't have to worry about Ganon. All right, well, that should be pretty cool. I hope. Ready, go. Yeah, she's out in the lead, so might make it a bit easier. I mean, she's obviously avoiding the conflict. I'm just gonna keep trying to get at her with this like damage raising thing and avoid Ganondorf because he's a little bit on the slow side here. Nice, oh, we already got her to 60%. Like, look at how good that is. All right, no you don't, no you don't, you get back here. She sort of tries to hit, but not too much. We're doing really well. Like Mega Man has like this good balance of being not too fast, but not too slow. Oh, no, no, I say that, and then I start messing up like crazy. All right, so I think I'm good to throw that, and then, yup, that was easy. That was so wonderful. I think I just played well there though. Poison damage reduced isn't gonna be that helpful. We already have poison immunity, so. The reduction's not really gonna be too much, too much of a valuable thing. Okay, so, let's keep moving. We got ourselves a battle to do. Who are we gonna unlock? It's Fox! Oh, cool. Win the battle to awaken the fighter. Let's give it a shot. I mean, I think I'm decent with Fox, so it'd be cool to unlock him, try him out a little bit. He, of course, has really cool music. 
All right, Mega Man versus Fox. Actually, a pretty cool combo. All right, get back up here, see what happens. That happens. Ah, oh, that is so cool that you can just do that. Hold on, <laughs> we're both trying to grab each other. There we go. Mmm. Mmm. See ya. Oh, that was bad. <laughs> but it's okay, it's okay. I make mistakes. Everybody does. Oh, that would've been so cool if we got him. Oh, that was awesome. Hold on, let's try that again. Cause I could probably get him out of here with that. Hold on. See ya! <laughs> that is so cool. Man, oh man, I love Mega Man. And Fox joins the battle. We'll have to check him out, like in, obviously we've already showcased him, but I wanted to play him a little bit in World of Light. That'd be fun. In the meantime, uh, I'm enjoying Mega Man. So what do we got next? The big pink button. I'll slam this thing, that'll be good. So is that the final door? Oh, that is the final door. So we'll definitely check that out soon. I don't know if we'll be doing that in today's episode. That's pretty cool. Oh, now this goes away, gotcha. Well, that's a nice little shortcut. See, so, yeah, next episode we'll go into that thing and find out what it is. Coraline from the Street Pass Me Pasta series taking over Isabel. I see the similarity. The enemy favorite side specials. Let's get to it. I mean, this seems to be an easy one. Like whenever the, like it only had 1800 power. Like, that's real easy. It's like the 10,000 plus ones you gotta worry about. Those are the ones that usually keep me up at night. Oh, we got a turtle shell? Perfect. And then I got it again. All right, see ya. That was, that couldn't have been easier. Could not have been easier. It's boomerang equip. Start battles with boomerang, deal damage. When you throw it and when it returns. Awesome. Well, there's that done. I've never played that game, the Street, Pla Pla Street Pass Plaza. Maybe at some point I will. You never know. Plenty of games to play out there. Okay, so with that done, we're gonna run over to the left where we have Expresso and also also another Donkey Kong Country. This one's from the original Donkey Kong Country taking over Falco. Guess because they're both birds. Um, slippery stage, the stage platforms are very slippery. The enemy has increased move speed and the enemy falls slowly. Well, we do already, I thought we had immunity to slippery fours. By date. Oh, sticky floors, Never mind. Uh, we'll try this. Breaking ability up will definitely be helpful because we can sort of control ourselves slowing down a little bit more. Because I guess you'll be a bit more airborne. He doesn't have to worry about the uh, platforms being slippery. But that we might be able to use that to our advantage. I don't know why we're on the Sonic stage out of all of them. Yep, there we go. Why was that so easy? The world may never know, but we got it done. Trade off speed, start battles with 30% damage and increased move speed. I don't know how I feel about that one, but it is very interesting of a concept. Only one skill sphere for that one. Probably have enough to improve stuff. Mega Man's back air was something. Apparently back airs are when you're in the air, whichever way your character is facing, like either left or right, if it's right and you move and you do like a, a right smash, that's a forward air. But then if it's facing away from then it's back air. That's what some of you guys let me know. All right, this is Shy Guy Me Brawler. The enemy favors neutral specials and the enemy is easily distracted by items. I feel like we did Shy Guy. No, we did Shy Guy on the spirit board. So this will be a duplicate, which is very cool. Then we can definitely summon away some duplicates after this. So it looks like going against some Me Fighters. Pretty cool. Okay, gotta be careful. But yeah, I, we definitely did this, the equivalent of this battle in the spirit board where it was all Shy guys and stuff. All right, you know what? I'm getting rid of this dude, maybe. Jeez, they're dodging me like crazy right now, actually. They're doing well. <laughs> whoa, 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 hold on. They exported that on themselves. Oh, I want that Galga, I want that Galga. No, it was supposed to be mine, you jerk. Okay, he's gonna be trying to get me here. I gotta be very careful. Okay, let me get the bumper and then no, stop. Oh, you guys are the worst right now. No! What was that? <laughs> oh my gosh, let me move! Let me move! Oh, no, 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 no. Okay, I'm fine, I'm fine. So we got rid of one of them. I think they actually got rid of themselves, and so did that guy. No, 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 no. Leave me alone. Okay, I am so gonna get you with my final smash here. There it is! Yes! Yes! Get him! Beat him up! It's just me and him. We can do it! Oh, it's so close, but at the same time, this really doesn't do as much damage as I wanted to, but it still knocks him away, so we did it. That was very, very close. First attack up for Shy Guy is always awesome to see. He's a neutral primary, so that's very good. 
Ah, oh, man. Cool map, though. Like, there was a lot of intense stuff going on there. And let's move this way. It's a Pokemon. Oh, cool, from Breath of the Wild. Tiny King K. Rule team. Yeah, like a team of Pokemon showing up. The enemy starts a battle with an ore club. Gotcha. I don't know if I should have taken that lipstick, but it's fine. We're doing pretty decent. I'm having fun with this one. Okay. It's making me miss Breath of the Wild. I plan on playing more of it. Some people have been asking when Breath of the Wild's coming back. Uh, I wanted to do it sometime after the new year. And now it's the new year. What do you know? But um, still busy with some games. Okay, got him with the crash there. That's nice. I think it's Crash Man's ability that has that. Maybe I'm wrong, like the bomb that attaches to him. A lot of the abilities seem to be from Mega Man 2. Okay, that was good. I'm gonna go ahead and grab one of these guys if I can. They all have the, well one of them has the ore club. The rest of them have, I think, just Killing Edge. No, no, no. I was doing well until I stopped doing so well. Oh, let me grab this. Is this a Steel Diver? I think it is. Oh, that would be really good to get and then just line up over here. No, let me use it, let me use it. Oh, this is gonna be very good. Cause they're just taking it for whatever reason. No, just let me hit him. Come on, come on, I just need to hit one more. Ah, oh, it's out, it's out of juice, okay. Yeah, that doesn't do any damage of special. No, no, no. No, let me just move. Let me just move. Let me just like get over here pretty please, thank you. And then, well I hit, oh I hit all of them! Yes, oh that is so cool, blast them! Because I always think it's just gonna hit what's in front of them, but it makes like a like a consuming like black sphere. So if you, as long as you're like in a good circle within them, that was so cool. I love his final smash. I could definitely get used to using that a little bit more. Because some of them are tough to land. Some of them are just really tough to land. Okay, so now that we've gotten that done, it looks like the smoke is gonna clear a little bit. And we have somewhere to go over this way if we want a treasure chest. It's Rock Mario from Mario Galaxy. A uh, metal Jigglypuff. Oh, I sort of see how that could be similar. Uh, the enemy's neutral special has increased power. The enemy favors neutral specials and the enemy is metal. So it's basically just gonna be Jigglypuff rolling around. Gotcha. I think we can handle that. I love Mario Galaxy. I wanna be playing it soon. <laughs> okay. Ooh. Be careful. Try to be careful with this. Ooh, nice. Yeah, his air, like I think that's his forward air then. Here, if I uh, experiment a little bit. Yeah, I think that's his forward air and then his back air. I sort of get it now. I like his forward air. Okay, I was trying to grab Jigglypuff there. There we go, give me this thing. And then blast you. Come on, get you back there. Just blast you, I just stack up that damage a little bit. Okay, oh, grabbing you. That worked, and then Mm, not bad. I like the up air. That's pretty good. Whoa, whoa, gotta be careful though. That's actually a big deal. I mean, I don't know what it does. Oh, it's gonna put me to sleep, isn't it? No, it's not. What in the world? I've never seen this before. I have never, ever seen this before. What in the world? That was crazy cool. She just gets really big. I'm supposed to be showcasing her next episode, I think. No, I missed. No, I didn't. Yeah, we're gonna get you. We're gonna get you good. See ya! Whoa, ho, 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 very cool. I still regret that the uh, final smash was uh, spoiled, but it's fine. Um, the power of punches, kicks, and bites, not bad, actually. I don't think it'd be too useful for uh, Mega Man. He seems to have a lot of ranged moves, but I do like the idea. Mid-air jump after rush coil. Oh, do we get an extra jump after we do rush coil? That's good to keep in mind. Okay, so, what is this gonna be? This is... 3,000 spirit points, not bad. I can't really go up this ice. I feel like at some point maybe I will be able to, but for now I can't. Over this way we got a gray pipe and we also got Chaotix. Oh, this is so cool from uh, Knuckles Chaotix. Uh, the conditions of the enemy is invisible. Well, we're gonna go at him. So are they all, like how many Sonics are there? Well, there's Sonic, King K. Roll, and Pichu, which I guess is obviously Sonic is supposed to be uh, the purple one. And then Pichu's supposed to be the B and then King K. Rool's supposed to be the crocodile. I love it, how inventive. Okay, they're all invisible now. And I don't know if I like that very much. But they're not permanently invisible, which is nice. And so far, I haven't taken any damage. And then, I'm gonna try to hit Pichu, and then bounce off this thing. I already got rid of him. I feel like Mega Man just works for me for some reason. It's very odd. Okay. No, I see ya. And then, it's just me and you, King K. Rool. I love this song, too. Oh, nice! 
Whoa, this is good. I love Mega Man. He's so cool. All right, so we got that done. Got a skill sphere out of it as well. I honestly was not expecting to like Mega Man as much as I do. Like his play style and everything is really fun. And I think we've been going over some mainly easy spirits, so that helps. So I can actually go this way. It's a great fairy, which is pretty awesome from The Legend of Zelda, of course. Giant Zelda, health recovery. The enemy's special moves have increased power. The enemy is healed significantly when the enemy is at high damage and the enemy's FS meter charges quickly. Let's see what we can do about that. Because now we had the, the final smash meter as well with uh, whatever that spirit was. Okay, whoa, she's really big. She's moving fast. This actually might be one of the more difficult giant battles. Usually they're not so bad, but this one seems crazy. 60% damage already? Oh my gosh. Oh, oh. Calm down, calm down. Don't mess with the great fairy. She's too tough. I can't wait to check out Zelda. She seems like a fun character. Get out of here with that. How'd I do that, by the way? Oh, that's a cool uppercut. Oh, I really like that. Okay. Oh, that was good. And then I'm starting to catch up a little bit. That is good. Wait. No, come on. Come on, come on. I'm pressing all the wrong buttons here. <laughs> there we go. Come on, get her again. Oh, she reflected that, didn't she? Okay, here we go, here we go, here we go. It went away. Darn it, that's, okay, that's how that works then. Gotcha. But yeah, she healed herself up a lot there. Hmm, just barely missed that one. But I can still grab her. Okay. Oh, that got her, that got her. Gotta be careful now, though. Oh no. Oh, there's no way that's gonna hit me, right? No, 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 really? Oh, that one I'm gonna argue and it's gonna knock me out. That's sort of baloney though, so far away. Guess I should've tried to get farther away. <laughs> should've just tried to jump off the edge. Not too much you could do about that, I guess. But that was a good fight, cause like she tore me up at the very beginning, but then I caught up. Oh, ooh, she immediately hit me there. Then I tried to jump so I can do the tornado. I like being able to juggle them with that. Oh gosh. Be careful. Not too familiar with that move either. Okay, very interesting. I'm just like, I feel like I am slowly but surely. What do I happen? Is it a banana? I think it's a banana. Oh, nice. I feel like I am slowly but surely getting a better hang of the nuances of this game in some ways. I mean, some people have been saying that I, they feel like I've been getting better, which I do appreciate the positive reinforcement, if not anything else, <laughs> even if it's lies. But I don't think, I mean, I don't think you guys are lying to me. That's not what I'm trying to say. Whoa, 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 she just kicked backwards. Okay, come on. I'm doing pretty gosh darn good here, but this is where she heals up. Hmm, but I'm just gonna have to take her back down. Cause I don't think, I think she can only get that heal once. It's not like every time she gets way up there, she gets that free heal. So I wanna try to get you higher up. Oh gosh, no, no, no. I don't know how my chances are at that. Nope, Ugh, probably should have done it while I had the chance, but I'm not done yet, I'm not done yet. I thought I was taken out there. Not quite, come on, come on. I need to eat that pineapple. I need to eat that pineapple, it's not happening. Okay, Ugh, give me that, it's mine. I can't get it. <laughs> come on, come on. I'm gonna toss it at you, and then I'm just gonna blast this at you too. Will that catch you? It will miss, gosh darn it. This is not turning out very well. I mean, it was going okay until, you know. Oh no, 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 no. There's nothing I can do about that. And then once I get into this, that is really, really tough. Continue. Really, really tough. I know I can do it though, we've gotten pretty close. It's just once we get her health down, it's like we're sort of rushing. Like when we get her health all the way up to 100 and then she heals Ready? or whatever it is, Go. that's when it gets scary because that's when we need to really be able to make things work and like destroy her before she gets her smash. Which like, this is a good start, but it's it's about sort of like beating her twice in a way. Which is not gonna be easy. Okay, that was pretty good though. Oh, oh, come on, come on, come on, come on. Ah, she's back down though. That was really good. If I could have gotten like an early takedown there, that would have been great. Just like before her heal could trigger, be amazing. Ow, ow, ow. 
But then, like, as soon as she gets healed back up, I feel like she goes, like, super overtime with how good she is. Because it gets more tough, for sure. Oh, I threw a boomerang there I didn't even see. Come on. Okay, I have my smash. She's at 50% health now. I missed, oh wait, no. That's gonna miss, unfortunately. I really messed that up. I'm like, I tried really hard not to mess it up, but I feel like the harder I tried, the more I messed it up. All right. Oh, man, that is, I feel like the more I do that, the harder I'm having a hard, I'm, more I'm having a hard time with it. No, I tried so hard to get away, it's impossible. She has a really good final smash. I don't know if there's anything you can actually do about that. Man, is this tough. Oh, that was good, that was good. Oh, she actually got her final smash before me this time, but it doesn't matter, we're able to get her. I really like that charge up blast, it's really good. Critical health healing recovers a great deal of health with when a certain amount of damage is taken. That's a really good fairy. I mean, a really good spear and a great fairy, what do you know? I'm surprised that isn't a legendary. I can definitely see some good uses with that one that will definitely use assist trophy stamina. If an assist trophy is emitting an aura, something happens, who knows what. That was very cool though, well worth the effort for that uh, spirit. And we get main theme, Yoshi's Woolly World. Ooh, nice song there, I like that one. So I don't know what's going on through this pipe, so we might as well go and check out. I'm pretty sure it's gonna be a shortcut to the opening of, yeah, everything we just unlocked. But we do have to actually do a little bit of something to get there. So we got Freezy from the Mario Bros. series taking over Ice Climbers. The condition is that the enemy starts a battle with a Freezy, so we're just gonna go ahead and do whatever we need to. Freezy, the good, you know, uh, thing against that is a fire Pokemon, which we have Rapidash, so let's see how things go. Okay, so I do start with the boomerang here, as you can see. I don't know how helpful this will actually be. We'll try it out. Actually, I don't really want it anymore. <laughs> okay, no, 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 get out of here. I'm just gonna toss it. No, I t it keeps coming back to me. So it's just, we already got rid of one of them. Gotta get rid of the other one now. Nice. Keep throwing them, if I can. That was pretty good. Nice, oh, look at that boomerang go. Not bad, actually. The boomerang won it for me, and I was trying to get rid of it. Start battles with the freeze, the hit opponents with it to freeze them. <laughs> okay, that could be pretty good, actually, potentially. If you could, like, freeze them and then just knock them off the map or something. I don't know what the chances of that actually are, but that would be pretty good. Okay, so, yeah, down this way is the opening to it, and then there's this whole area I've yet to explore, really, so that could be really good. Before we tackle that too much, let's try this out. This is the 1080 series. Um, Akari Hayami, Wii Fit Trainer. Uh, the stage platforms are very slippery, and the item is freezy again. Interesting. So, the 1080 series is a snowboarding game that I think was on the Nintendo 64. Interesting that's on here. And there was also the snowboarding game SSX, which is a really cool one. I love that one. Played that a lot when I was younger. Ooh, not bad, not bad. I'm trying to do the... There's like an up A uppercut, there it is. It's super cool, I like it. These freezies are beating us up though. Here, maybe I could pick one up and throw it at you. Here. If I could throw it at you when you're in the air, I think theoretically you just fall to your doom. Uh, I don't know if it lasts that long now is the problem. You definitely do get a second jump after your, your uh, up special. Okay, let's try to get you. We almost got you already. Yeah, there's no way. So like that doesn't last long enough for it to actually be a takedown, unfortunately. That's good, ooh, just brought you right up to the top. I love Mega Man. Damages enemies when dashing into them. Pretty cool. So with that being done, Summit Fish, yeah, that's the map we were just playing on. Very weird map, but I like it, <laughs> it's pretty fun. Uh, moving over this way, there's like plenty of icy stuff to get to around here. There's Absol, let me take a look at this then. Like, where does this lead? Like, this is a whole thing in and of itself that we'll have to explore. But there's Gengar and everything. There's that bus that we take somewhere. I don't know what that little thing is. Huh, not entirely sure. But that little square diamond looking thing. I'm gonna keep going up this mountain for now. We're just gonna keep playing until we get to an hour in today's episode. Uh, this is Absol. The enemy starts a battle with Death Scythe. Ooh, that's scary. Oh, we got the fairy as well. That'll be cool to try out. So if we get really like high up on a percentage, we get to be reset down. Like that sounds really good. <laughs> I don't know if that works in stamina battles. Maybe we could try it at some point. Next time we run into a stamina battle. But Death Scythe can be a tough one. Okay, 
Hold on, buddy. <laughs> oh, I'm grabbing you. I'm throwing you. And when you get over here, I'm gonna mess it up. Ooh. You know what? Let's try this. Not what I wanted. I wanna do the... It's not easy to do. For whatever reason. There it is. That uppercut is so cool. I love that. I don't think any... I don't think there's a Mega Man power that's just an uppercut. He just has that because he's Mega Man. <laughs> okay, so there's that done. And where are we going against next? We have Condor from the Ice Climber series, uh, Ice Floor, which we sh should be fine against. Defeat the main fighter to win. The floor is frozen, time stamina battle. I'm gonna try this. I don't know if it's gonna really be ne needed, but we'll see if we get our health restored when we get low on stamina. But I do see the the similarity between these two. Oh, and there's also ice climbers. Oh, okay, so I understand ice floor now. I mean, I probably should have checked to see if there was an ice floor immunity I may have had. Okay. I mean, they're both really low in health already, so I think we'll be fine. Hold on. Hold on. There we go. Almost got him. Ridley's just chilling out over there, because he knows I'm too much for him. He's just, yeah, he's just hiding from me now. Get back here. So I was doing really well at first, but now I'm starting to really run low on health. Got him! Is that all I needed? Or do I need to take out? No, I don't even need to. Awesome. I'll, I'll gladly do that. Strong wind resist. I already had that, but it's good to have another one. I was hoping that would be the ice floor resist that I probably needed there. But we turned out pretty well, so it's fine. A spirit's defensive power will affect shields too. Ooh, cool to know. So can we even go? If yeah, the path is frozen solid, you probably slip if you continue. So I can't, but I can. Oh, oh, no, I can. Oh, interesting. We got a polar bear. I sort of want to go back up that. <laughs> probably should have done that first. Let's try the polar bear from the Ice Climber series as well. How cool is that? Uh, the rule is earthquake rule item freezy. The enemy has super armor, but moves slower. Stamina battle. Uh, periodic earthquakes will shake the stage. So, falling immunity? How does that work? That's not what I want to do. Grants immunity from tripping from earthquakes. So not like falling into a pit kind of falling. We'll try this, we'll see what ends up happening. Because apparently, are there earthquakes? Yeah, periodic earthquakes will shake the stage. We'll be fine with that, how cool. Ready? I mean, I feel like we already had a character that was immune to that, but it's good to have another one. Oh, DK has a lot of stamina. So he is like the polar bear, I see. I can't grab him though, I think he's too big. This doesn't stop him from grabbing me, though. So I gotta be very careful about that. And then, I wanna do the uppercut. I don't know why, like it sometimes works, and it sometimes does not. <laughs> you have to like press A right after pressing up, but not like too slow or too soon. It's very odd. It's a very like specific set of movement there. What is he doing? I don't know, but it's working. Oh, that was good. Oh, that was good as well. It's very hard to do anything about him. He just sort of jumps up and near me. I don't know if this is, oh, no wait. Don't you dare hit me with your smash when I'm almost done with you. <laughs> All right, that was not bad though. If the polar bear makes it more difficult to flinch or something. All right, I'll take it. So if the polar bear taken down, I'll go and deal with this Metal Gear thing. That might be good. It'll be nearly wrapped up with today's episode. Uh, so this one right here, this is the Metal Gear Ray from Metal Gear Solid taking over Metal Greninja out of all things, pretty interesting. Seven to battle, the explosion attacks aren't as effective against the enemy, the enemy is metal. We'll just do this, because the game wants me to. Even though I don't have a sword, so I don't know why it gave me sword attack up, a sword of baloney. Probably should have chose something else. I love this song, but for whatever reason, well I know the reason. This this song always reminds me of Little Big Planet, because there's a Metal Gear Solid DLC in Little Big Planet. And that's sort of, that's how I know, uh, Metal Gear from? Like, I, I didn't know it as a game, but I knew there was a Little Big Planet DLC. Don't you dare, oh, you stinker. And that doesn't even hurt you? Hmm, okay, hold on. I wanna uppercut you so bad, and I missed it. There it is! Okay, that was worth it. And then I wanna jump. Okay, uh-oh, I think I'm caught. I'm in big problem, big trouble. There we go, we got him though, before any kind of Metal Gear could do anything to me. That was cool. All right, we get Metal Gear Ray, and the weight is up. But beyond that, looks pretty good. It is a grab primary, so we'll be able to work with that. Okay, so with that one done, 
What are we doing now? We are moving this way. What is this about? Can any of my current characters do this? It's space. Oh, look, you can. I think you're from Star Fox. What is this? Okay, I'm gonna have to explore this sometime later. That's a whole episode in and of itself. Just exploring space? Where's my character? Yeah, just like a whole solar system over there. How cool is that? Oh my gosh, I can't wait to explore that. Okay, so what's going on over this way? Yeah, there's nothing to the, the right, so then I might wanna just go to the left, where there is, oh, another character to unlock. It's Ice Climbers, how fitting. We already have Ice Climbers unlocked in the main game, but it's cool to unlock them here. Very awesome. Win the battle to awaken the fighter, I would love to. Okay. So I think I, I didn't even like, oh, that was good. So I already got rid of one of them. So this battle's turning out pretty well so far. We both have a very similar move there. <laughs> a little bit of copy paste. Nice. And then try to get back up, see what happens, nothing. Ooh. Oh, nice block from me. No, 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 there it is. And then, oh. Don't you dare use that. Oh, I got the tornado on you. Oh, be careful, be careful. Oh boy. I don't know if Ice Climbers are particularly good fighters. Like, I'll have to like definitely check them out at some point. I don't know if they're like really, really well-revered fighters in this game. There we go. Ooh, whoop. Yeah, nice. All right, so we unlocked Ice Climbers in World of Light. Like I said, we already had them in the main game, but it's good to see them here. We got a ton of skills spheres for it, and I think with that, we're about wrapped up with everything. I mean, we of course still have to go back and do whatever battle we're gonna end up doing for playing World of Light in today's episode. Ooh, will that make it so that we can climb through here without a problem? Oh, it does, so we can backtrack if we wanted to. And there's something to the left that I'm a little confused on. I'm real curious about it, though. And now we can go through there as well, which that's another place we haven't explored. But what is this, whoa, that is weird. I sort of like just go between the trees there in a weird way. What is this? Like my curiosity. Oh, it just works it back here. That's sort of a little lame. Anyways, that was a lot of fun. We were able to open up this mysterious castle and I think maybe we'll also explore that in the next episode. There's tons to do. But for now, that's gonna wrap it up with this. We're going to go and go, actually just, yeah, hold back. So much fun. I actually had a really good time with World of Light in today's episode. Oh my gosh, finally, yes! Oh my gosh, we gotta win. I'm gonna cry if we don't win. <laughs> All right, buddy, we're at your mansion, but it won't be for long. Ooh. Get out of here, how did that not land? Oh, oh, whoa, whoa, he's got some moves. He's got some moves. Come on, come on. No, 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 no. Pretty close battle so far, but I'm not gonna let it stay that way. Oh no. Ooh, nice. Okay. Nope, that's not what I wanted. <laughs> oh gosh, this is too close. It's too close. No. Oh, that was good. I like it. And then when he gets over here, I'm gonna blast him. Yes, we got him, finally. It just took 20 episodes, but Luigi joins the battle. We'll check him out next episode, and then we'll check out Jigglypuff. I am so gosh darn happy. We get the minor circuit music from Punch-Out. We get 1,500 spirit points for getting those things done. What is going on in this image? I don't know. <laughs> Leave the spirit at the gym three times. Oh, they're training in the gym. I think we also got, not this one. We got one of these. I don't know which one it was. How cool is that? Could things have really gone better in today's episode? I argue they couldn't have. So next episode, stay tuned for Luigi Showcase. The episode after that, maybe more World of Light will go into that castle. Lots of stuff, cool stuff coming up. I hope you're excited. But for now, thank you guys so much for watching today's episode of Super Smash Brothers Ultimate. If you want to support the video, make sure you comment Mega Zebra, so you have watched at the end of the URA Zebra Tasty Viewer. Check out more episodes like this one on your screen right now, or by subscribing to join the Zebra Herd. Either way, thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye bye.